Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda HD. The Wind. Did I do it again? The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. Holy smokes. Um, so we're in the Dragon Roost Cavern. We had to help Medley get up here last time by throwing her into the wind. First, giving her a concussion. Swimming across this moat, and here we are. So let's get started. This is. One of the dungeons of the game. I don't know why I phrased it like that. Oops. Okay, cool. Not what I meant to to do to start off. But one of the things that I did notice about... Are you kidding me? Really, game? The checkpoint is all the way back across the pond? That's lame. Um, so I saved the game in between episodes, obviously. Saved my progress. The checkpoint for where it puts you back is the beginning of the island, which I think sucks. Um, I had to go all the way from the outside to the inside. It almost just makes me wish that I would have um, just continued the recording. Oh, I wasn't even close. Do two episodes in one. I had no idea that it was going to spit me back this far. It's not... Oh my gosh. Can the checkpoint be here now? Really? Game, what is your problem? Who peed in your Cheerios? My goal was to do this dungeon today, but I'm not feeling super confident that that's going to happen. All this gosh dang time wasting. If you like time wasting and being reset to the beginning of dungeons, consider liking the video, commenting, subscribing. I'd like some feedback if anybody is interested in providing that for me. Tell me what you think so far. I'm just a little surprised. I thought that this was a popular game and people were enjoying this. I'm not really getting a ton of views on this. I'm not complaining about it or anything, but um, I just figured this would be a bit of a winner. Wow. Why I'm not in the NBA. People are really vibing with Odyssey, which I'm happy about. Not getting as much traction on this one, unfortunately. I'd like to figure out why that is. I have no idea perplexing to me but here we are inside dragon roost cavern i mean not technically yet we are in the f the lobby or the foyer if you're fancy i actually have had moments in the past where i've said that oh it's the foyer they're like uh excuse you it's foyer this is america all right so let's go ahead and sneak on in here once we pull this to the side just a little little puzzle. Probably one of the hardest in the game, actually. And here we are. This is the... Whoop! Just gonna go ahead and whoop, sneak right past you. Boop, 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 boop. I don't know why I said sneak right past you. It's not what I did at all. I just kind of jumped out of the way. That's okay. Ooh, a joy pendant. How lucky. We actually do need that, of course. In the future for whatever her face is. Right, let's climb up here, light these torches, and see what our prize is. I bet it's something great like a compass. It's been a long time since I've played this dungeon or any, you know, meaningful part of this game, so I really don't remember what or, or what anything is. So I'm going to basically be relying on probably muscle memory. Oh, it's a key. I was actually going to start complaining, but I don't need to now. That makes sense. It's always fun when you get a key in the room that you use it. All right. So, I'm going to do my best to power through this one. We've got a lot of lava. We're going to need to be riding that eventually. Looks like there's another key door here that we can't access yet. Oops. Having a little bit of trouble with my uh, pro controller. Go ahead and pull this block out. Knock your block off. All right. I don't think I can jump there from here. Can I? Oh, shoot, I can. Look at you, Link. You got some hops. Good job, bud. Whoa! Almost got consumed by that fiery cyclone of doom. No, thank you. There's our favorite classic Zelda enemy, the keys. Just give me the keys. Mm. If you actually do intend to pursue a smooch from somebody, Doing what I just did may or may not get you popped in the mouth. All right, so here we go. This is a 
kind of a strange mechanic, but what we're doing here is creating... Okay. Apparently... <laughs> apparently that worked. I'm not entirely sure how. But we're creating platforms by throwing these pots of water into the lava. Actually, technically, it's magma. Lava's what comes out from the volcano. All right. And is this a volcano? Like, I don't know. I'm not trying to split hairs here on what sort of geological formation this is that we're inside of. It just says cavern, so. Ooh, okay. That's, you know, pretty uncool of you. But the benefit is that we get a free red choo-choo jelly. Love that. Love that for us. I'm not 100% sure what the choo-choo jellies do. I want to say that it is... Um, oh, jeez. Okay, sorry. Hey, I'm pooping in here. That's probably why he was upset. It's just, it's so disrespectful if somebody's in there, you know, burning it up, and then you think that you're just going to waltz on in, huh? Can I climb up here with this sword? No, I can't. Once again, multiple elements of uh, of this game so far that are mystifying me. I'm always unaware of these things. This is this a key? It is. Okay. I'm doing this primarily off of muscle memory. There's probably going to be a point where I get very lost, which is going to be sad because this is the second dungeon of the game. Oh man, there's two two more of these boys. Whoop. It's a shame we can't just keep this, like, machete with us after the fact. That's it. You just... You use it and you lose it. Okay. Alright, so I'm assuming they want us to throw a pot here at these bombs. Do a little chain reaction. Okay. I guess not. Maybe I just missed. There we go. Uh, viewers... Let's show some respect to my puzzle solving abilities. That was epic. Are we past the point of epic? Viewers, have we lost epic? Remember back in the good old days, epic? Do we remember that? Vocabulary changes so fast. It's one of the things that I think is the most polarizing for some people is the language that we use and it makes us feel connected in a way. Some people really don't like that words change. I'm not gonna pretend like I'm somebody that is, you know, an ambassador for the language I speak. There's plenty of moments where there's things that I hear that I don't understand. I'm not against language improving and changing and evolving, but um, I think it just depends upon how you use it. Some people use it to be intentionally misleading and confusing. All right, let's burn this up. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do that. Yeah, but I'm not going to pretend that I'm some, like, hyper-progressive person who's always like, Oh, yeah, you know, I'm going to say what everybody else says. I get lost in certain ways, too, with the things that I do and I say, so... I'm not immune to it. I've had my grumpy yells at clouds moments, I'm sure. Get away from me. Ooh, no! Oh, that was giving me the the parry dodge roll animation, and I totally whiffed on that. What is this? Oh, it's like oh, it's leaking. Make sure you shake it before you put it back. Oh, these are annoying. Got these gosh dang birds here. Come here. Oh yeah, get over here. You ever wanted to just fight a giant bird while you're climbing a volcano? What did you give me? One rupee. Boo! Can you give me the... the thing? <laughs> Can I get a better look at this? No, I'm tilting the camera the right way! <laughs> I'm sorry, I need... I need a little bit more of this. This may be exactly what you think that it's going to be, but I think it's funny. Oh, you're never going to catch me. All right. That's enough goofing around, viewers.
Okay. We're already 10 minutes in. We gotta finish this up in the next 15 to 20-ish minutes. Alright, so nope. We gotta hang on. This is like a Ninja Warrior puzzle. The ultimate cliffhanger. I used to really watch the crap out of that show. Back in the days of uh, when I had cable when I was a child. Um, G4? Anybody watch G4? It's a gaming channel. Wasn't really big into it in general. I wasn't like a big gaming uh, content consumer. Uh, oh, that, that was an epic shot. Two epic shots in one episode. Um, yeah, they used to show reruns of Ninja Warrior. And I don't think it was Ninja Warrior. I don't think the American version had existed yet. So we were a little far removed from that. It is impressive that Lincoln pull these, considering they're all stacked up like that. You would expect them to be too heavy for his little baby hands. All right, so make yourself a nice little pyramid. This is going a little bit too smoothly and I'm kind of scared. I feel like I'm doing something wildly incorrect. Ooh. Oh, rats. Ooh, they gave me the, the parry animation for the rats too. Tetra, go away. Oh, maybe I was supposed to talk to her. Maybe that's, it was not the parry animation. Bait near the nest? Okay, I mean, I have that. Don't I? Items? This would be much easier to do with the, uh, whatever you call it, the whatchamacallit? Uh, okay, I do have bait. Okay. They're gonna share their treasures with me? Ooh, trying to steal from me. Ruthless. Okay, I definitely threw it the wrong direction. Delicious, oh, it speaks English. Sell to you for real. What'll it be for you? All-purpose bait, three scoops, a hoi pair. I mean, we did use the one hoi pair. Is that a good deal? I don't remember how much we paid for it. I do not remember. Um, so you can, I guess if you need that, you can get it. A little strange that that's what that was all about. I'm not entirely sure the need of that interaction, but I'll take it, I guess. Is this a key or is this like a compass? The compass, or as some people say, compass, and makes my brain hurt. This is another one of those moments of like, me in language not being the best of buds. Okay, so I probably need, I would have to guess, one of them fire sticks. I need one of those really crappy use your TV Oh wait, oh do I have to throw it? Maybe I can throw it. Viewers, do you think I can make it from there? I have no idea if I can just launch it. Oh man, look at the cannon on Link. Yeah, I, I mentioned this already. Getting dangerously concerned about the fact that I'm doing this a little bit more comfortably than I would have expected to now. Mind you, there's probably plenty of dungeon left to do, but you know, I am me. So there's a good chance that things will go awry very quickly. Like how I'm not even looking up above of where I'm going. Oh, what's up, bud? Hey, what's going on? Oh, you got the key back there. I'm gonna take it. Ooh, oop. <laughs> Try to slam dunk. Bird was not having it. What a creepy enemy. What do you turn into? Oh, money. Take your house key though, thanks. Appreciate ya. Okay. Be careful walking back, you don't want to just slip and fall. I don't know what the checkpoint is and I'm not going to test it. All right, more flaming sticks, flaming hot Cheetos. I actually just talked to somebody about that the other day, coincidentally. Not that it matters for this Let's Play or anything, but um, we did have a discussion about Flamin' Hot Cheetos and how I feel like as a food, a consumable, I mean, I think it's food. Um, I'm probably just a little baby. Should not be Z targeting these. These keys are kind of creepy, but kind of adorable at the same time. 
Um, I struggle to safely consume another joy pendant. That's three. Nectar filled blossom. That's great. I don't care. Um, I struggle to eat them and not feel like ultimate garbage on the other side. <sighs> of course. I feel like it has to do with how artificial they are. And maybe that's good, you know? That my body is like, hey, we are not capable of surviving on, you know, styrofoam covered in chili powder. One of the things I do know about um, Flame Hot Cheetos, there's that story about how there was that guy who was like, oh boy, he was the janitor at Frito-Lay and he was in one of their Mexican offices where chili powder is a frequently used thing in their cuisine. Oh, that was perfect. That's three in a row. I mean, not really because I had to do different things, but um, there's that myth that he was like, yeah, if you take, you know, take your Cheetos and you just cover them in uh, chili powder, it'll turn into this amazing new snack. And apparently that's not true at all. So take that for what it's worth. I have plenty of fun facts, and also, I'm a fun fact destroyer. Alright, let's charge up the old spinner attack. And a boo- Oh. He lost his sword. I was like, why are you attacking me? Is there anything in these? I don't care. Ooh. An enemy. That's great. You go back to your home. Ooh, the parry attack. And I parried myself right into him. <laughs> Not the best move. Oh, another joy. Okay, I'm not sure what the overall... Oh, come on. I feel like killing these guys is probably required to advance. I don't know what the amount of joy pendants is that I should have by now. But I have three, four? Four of them? I think in order to progress with, with Teach, I think that you need... Um, I want to say 25. I don't know if that's true. Could be making it up. Ooh, there's another one. Are they this plentiful or am I just getting lucky? I don't know. Not really that concerned. Progress is kind of the name of the game. Ooh, I don't like this. I don't like your kind. These weird Magnus centipedes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get used to these guys. They're going to be around for a hot minute. I'm just gonna kind of sneak around you. Oops. I did not mean to do that. Can I throw you into the lava and you just die? See you. Bye. Okay. Um. That's annoying. Oh, you're alive again. Stop. Stop being alive. What's the thing that people do nowadays because they can't say certain words on social media without getting demonetized? Is it unalive? Is that what it is? Referring to people that take their own life? Well, good thing I'm not trying to monetize anything, so I can say... What now? This is a family-friendly show. Alright. I don't need to kill this guy. I just want him to go away. Because I have chores to do. Please. Oh my gosh. This encounter is taking me many minutes. Alright, that's good. I think I'm just gonna try to dance around him. Oh wait, is that what I needed? Create that platform. Stop. All right, I want you to come back down. All right, get out of my way. I have no sugar for you. I want to try to finish this dungeon today. I don't. I mean, we're 20 minutes in, and almost 20 minutes in, and I feel pretty good about it. I mean, I'm making pretty good gosh dang progress here. Let's not, let's not get it sideways, okay? I'm trying to put together a, an enjoyable run through of a game that I hope you all like. Oh, get out of here. A little perplexing though. I thought Wind Waker was super popular. I mean, I, the, the channel is still small and, you know, we're still young and learning. But I figured you guys would like it more. All right, I don't know what this does. I want to say that that's like a warp. We blew the top off the pot from before, and it might be related to that in some capacity. 
Alright, so that's a door to progress. Do we have any of the water pots? Not seeing them. Which means that we can't... Oh, that might be the boss door. And I think I know why we can't progress, because we don't have the right item. And this is where you get it. Oh, there he is! There's our boy! He's had too many flaming Hot Cheetos, what do you say? It's like me whenever I have dairy. Are these stairs crumbling behind us? Yes, they are! Okay, so yeah, this is uh, kind of what opens up the second part of the dungeon. Medley has been trapped because she's a big old dummy. We're gonna do our best to fight these guys. I don't, I don't know if these are moblins or. Make sure you do your jumps, you do your jumps. Crisscross will make you jump, jump. I like they kind of give you the the old west music or the wild west. There's another joy pendant, man. I'm just racking these up. This might be one of those dungeons though where it's like. They're plentiful, and so I'm getting excited about a commodity that's probably just all over the place. Okay, that's a Moblin. So, I don't know. Come on, do your thing. Oof. <laughs> I definitely tried to hit the A button, but it did not let me. Taking an unnecessarily large amount of time. Just gonna stab you right in your chest. Right in the chesticles. He doesn't have his spear anymore, so we can't play any defense. Let's get to him before he can recover. Nice. Okay, not too bad. I'm not gonna pretend like I'm remotely good at any form of combat in this game, because I am not. Alright, let's go talk to Medley and her dumb captured self. Not really. I mean, you kind of goofed on this one. Oh, do you have the poops? I'm sure. It's probably... It is probably the poops. That's why he's so angry. Oh, I have diarrhea! Oh no, poor Valu. Maybe. It would be really cool if, um... Maybe there'd be an item you could give me to help progress? It's a device that the reader used before wings. The grappling hook! Okay, so this is kind of a situational item. It becomes part of the boat eventually. But for now, we're just going to use it to kind of... Nope. Oh, I have six. I didn't know I had that many. We're going to use it to Indiana Jones ourselves around this dungeon. Great! Thanks! Don't worry about me like- oh, don't worry, I wasn't. Alright, so... Because I'm not using motion controls... Which... Initially there weren't any because this is a GameCube game. Whoop! Don't know why I did that. <laughs> Clearly they want you to do it again. Use the grappling hook twice. I feel like maybe... I can finish this. I can... I might be able to beat this off in one try. If I'm quick. But I don't remember what the keys to the kingdom are for beating the boss. All right. So now that we're here, do we need to go over here? I mean, I'm assuming you do? Wait. What was back in here? Yeah. So there's clearly the T's up above is that you can't cross the moat because you don't have this yet, the grappling hook. Now that you do, please, don't play games in my games. Ooh, just jumped right over him, that's cool. I feel like I probably need, this is probably a, a collectible. The Knight's Crest. What is this, Fire Emblem? I'm gonna promote my Cavalier. I do enjoy Fire Emblem, I actually play it pretty regularly. Of course, most of you know it was a pretty favorable thing in my, um, in my previous channel. I played both Fire Emblem Just and, uh, oops, please don't touch me, Fire Emblem Just and the sequel to that, which in order of numbers, it's six followed by seven, 
or seven followed by six. I don't know. I had the numbers right in my head. I was super excited to say something about it. And then I completely goofed on getting the words out the old dumb mouth hole. Okay, great. At least it tells you, it gives you like a heads up of like, hey, this is, this is when you got it. Would be nice if I could just do it the first time. Okay, so we're swinging around town. Driving fast, faces past, and we're homebound. Okay. So coming down here, I'm assuming we need to go this direction in order to... Why did that animation play twice? Um, there's a mob on here. Ha ha ha, sucks. Gotta fight this boy. I was just gonna give him a little bit of space to recover. It's just a nice thing to do. Chivalry is not dead. This one dead? But chivalry's not dead, but these guys are. All right. Great. Now this should spawn a key. But how do we get down there, viewers? Hmm. Well, funny you should ask. Well, you can... Ooh, that, that face that Link makes during that is really creepy. All right. I know for a fact that I'm not gonna... Tetra, what do you want? Looks like Link is reaching right. Oh. Okay, thanks. I'm trying to show the viewers. One of the things you can do, of course, is hack and slash. Well, that was enough. Apparently not. The game's like, no more. Hey, did you not see that the thing is underneath the stuff, dummy? All right, how many of these do I need to do? All of it? Who has time for that? See, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna speed it up. Work smarter, not harder. There we go. And then you can scoot on down. Of course, snap Link's ankles. Are you kidding me? Is that, mm, that's all that was down here? There better be another one. Oh, I don't think so. I'm trying to find a good place to stop because I don't think that this is going to, this is going to be Something I really have all the time for. I'm not gonna be able to beat the boss today, I don't think. Okay. Boost me up. I mean, I feel good about it. Like, I feel like I'm doing really well, but I got a little caught up early and I don't want this episode to be super long and hard. What do I... There we go. Looking at you here. When in doubt, look up. I think this pulls... This is like a lever or something. Yep. They just want you to do that, I guess. And then you have to... Get attacked by bats. I almost said bees. Thankfully, we can do a little backwards hop and skip that. Classic pro gamer skip. I'm a bit of a speedrunner myself. Said nobody me. That didn't make any sense. I want to say said nobody ever, but that's not true. Said nobody that doesn't do those things. All right. So we need to change position here. Because that doesn't actually lead you anywhere. Just to encourage you to switch locations. And then we can come here. I hope. I mean... This is an older Zelda game, therefore it is required by law to be linear. Okay, this looks like a place where I'm gonna fight stuff. Okay, probably hit this. Well, you never know what you're gonna need, so okay. Come here. No, stop it. You know, quit your business. So the thing that I need, of course, is, <laughs> of course, is in the fire and the flames. And I cannot carry on. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, this is annoying, huh? Yeah. 
Now don't do that again. Doctor's orders. No, don't sidle, you dummy. I just want to put you down. No, no. Oh. <laughs> and on the rebound, he scores. All right, this is the big old chesticle. That's the big guy. All right. And we just need to get back to where we were. To whence we came. I'm assuming it's just a matter... Oh my gosh. Fire keys. Whoa. Oh, cool. Yeah, I don't I don't like that. I don't like that animation of, of Link making that face. I don't like these fire keys either. I'm going to try to just speed this up. Get away from me. All right. So I think it's just a matter of, I guess, retracing my steps. Which... Oh boy. No, stay away. Oof. Get away. Okay, so the grappling hook is useful for that. Grappling hooks also, when you are facing certain enemies, it will allow you to pluck a consumable. No, collect. Oh boy, nope. Oh, viewers. I'm just trying to find a good place to stop. Why don't you go over here? Yeah, boy. Sniped you. Yeah, I don't like, I don't like this game's insistence on on checkpointing and just really putting you back a little bit further than you should be. That's not fair. Am I low in health? Oh, I kind of am. All right. No, not, okay. <laughs> oh, viewers. I feel like I owe it to myself to get this crazy puzzle done. Thank you. I'm just trying to find a good place to stop. One of the trickiest dungeon puzzles in all of Zelda history. Okay. I just need to be patient. One more swing ought to do it. No. Oh, that's really frustrating, actually. Um... You know what, I'm actually going to probably just call it quits here, and we will wrap up Dragon Race Cavern next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been The Legend of Zelda HD Wind Waker. Wind Waker HD. I'll see you next time. Bye.